Now, in the Democratic Republic of Congo, the endangered mountain gorillas share their natural habitat with rural communities. Our next report takes a look at how an organization is now leading awareness campaigns for school children and inhabitants to protect the endangered species. Take a look. In the eastern part of the Democratic Republic of Congo, rural communities share the forest with unusual neighbors, gorillas. According to the International Union for the Conservation of Nature, the mountain gorilla is endangered. Currently, there are around 1,600 mountain gorillas living in Uganda, Rwanda and the Democratic Republic of Congo. This is why leading conservation and awareness campaigns is essential. The Gorilla Ambassadors program is a local organization doing just that. Today, they're visiting school children near Virunga National Park, a UNESCO World Heritage Site since 1979. Children were taught the importance of preserving the species and its natural habitat. Le choix a été porté aux enfants parce que ils sont le futur gestionnaire. Ce qu'on conserve, c'est pour eux, c'est pour l'avenir, et c'est eux qui vont continuer à gérer. Et il est utile et il est de mère de les engager, de les amener à connaître ce qu'ils sont appelés à conserver dans le futur. Ils sont les bénéficiaires parce que. C'est eux qui vont continuer à vivre, à respirer l'air, à, à bénéficier de tous les avantages qu'offre la nature qui est en train d'être conservée ici. The children, now Gorilla Ambassadors, marched to show their support for the preservation efforts and for the primates. Mountain gorillas are threatened by habitat loss, poaching of bushmeat and the effects of an ongoing civil instability in the region. The park where they live was added to the UNESCO list of World Heritage in Danger in 1994. By targeting children first, they hope to change their habits from a young age and also have them change the behaviors and attitudes of both future and older generations. Nous nous attendons à ce que cette population s'engage et devienne le protecteur de ces gorilles ici au Parc National de Viron. During a forum, several inhabitants living around the park complained about the damage gorillas are causing to their crops. Kulima pembeni ya park, gorilla ni amuzuri sana. Alakini problem enya tunapata ni sababu ya mimea. Sa enya tunasema tunalima, unenda kutana mimea yote ilisha kuliwa. Virunga National Park is at the heart of the region affected by insecurity since the resurgence of the March 23rd movement, a rebel military group. The area is subject to intense fighting. Last November, a park warden was killed during a violent attack on a Congolese Institute for the Conservation of Nature patrol post. La résurgence du M23 affecte très négativement le, de, le, le suivi des gorilles dans les parcs nationaux de Virunga parce que Depuis qu'ils sont, depuis que le M23 occupe le secteur Agori, le suivi ne plus n'existe plus. Donc, nous, on ne fait plus le suivi. Donc, on ne connaît plus la santé de ces gorilles. On ne connaît plus le nombre. On ne connaît plus si il y a des naissances, s'il y a des morts, parce que ça fait plus de six mois maintenant que ils sont délaissés à leur propre sort. The M23, which also calls itself the Revolutionary Army of Congo, is a former rebel group backed by Rwanda and Uganda. It was defeated in 2013. Since November, the movement has been accused of being behind several attacks against the army. The attacks took place in the vicinity of Virunga National Park. The Virunga National Park covers an area of 7,800 square kilometers, which includes the volcanoes of the Virunga Range. It borders the Volcanoes National Park in Rwanda and the Queen Elizabeth National Park in Uganda. Bureau Report, Vion. World is One. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.